outside, you can't really tell anything's going on there. And it doesn't look like anything different in from the grill or from the window here. There's my thinking headlight to put in another video. So what we're gonna do now is get my coffee. So clearly it's off right now, not running. I'm gonna use the remote start to see if it comes on when your remote start, right? So just this little guy. Uh, it's kind of hard to see. It does not appear like the head unit has come on. So that's fine though. But we I turned on auto sleep last night, so let's see if it works or not. Unlocked it. I brought this guy in too. You can see it just. Fits right in there. This guy pops up a little bit. I'll fix that somehow. Got my coffee. Alright. Here we go. I'm gonna try to start it up, and the screen should automatically come on. Boom. Alright. Now, the question is does it recognize that micro SD card? That's why I tied my Bluetooth phones to it. There we go, no error message. So, uh, I'm pretty sure we got ourselves a winner here, right? Uh, no error message over sleep. That was the problem with the SATA. Um, join didn't fit the dash properly, right? Uh, it was just slapped in there. There's the micro SD card in the daytime. And... So the SATA had that bug where it wouldn't recognize after sleep and this uh, app switcher button would disappear. And, but I fixed that. Uh, this one does not have that problem so far. Right? I'm I haven't updated this or anything. I'm all messing with it. I don't know my date's wrong. It was right last night. But uh, let's just fix it. Uh, also, I did make a Bluetooth phone call, and my wife said it found, sounded fine. Just one call. I'll test it more, of course. Uh, so let's go to... Should be dating time in here somewhere. Yeah, set to China. That's the problem. Uh, all right, so you want to turn off this one, and then I'll set it to China time. Turn this off to... Not set to China time. Set it to... Eastern Standard Time, which is what I'm in. So, it's Eastern Daylight Time, right? 11-11, that's my anniversary. Not today, the time, 11-11, right? Uh, so feel free to buy me presents. Alright, so... Alright, so we got our Network Provide Time, we got Network Provide Time Zone. I uh, don't want to use 24 hour format. There we go. Uh, I was hoping it would show AM or PM, but it's not. Alright, so. Looking good. So far. Uh, oh, yeah. And. Like I said, I have two devices. The. Uh, I got my. My Z2 Force here. So we're going to try to connect that one. Let's see if it connects. And I don't know if it did or not. Alright, let me just get connected from my phone. I guess maybe two of them in here is a little more complicated. Alright, so there you see it's green, so it's connected. And uh Let's see, I didn't update my phone book or anything like that. I did make a phone call, put some pictures, a cool thing about where the old MTCD units and the Joy Intel units for Join. You could not, uh, it would not, it would just take over the whole screen. On this one, you can minimize it. I'll put a picture in there so you can see. Uh, but let's go to this, yeah, this absolute one up here. Not that. 
So you got your A2 DP, which is my music. So on my phone, when I got Howard Stern running, so let's try it out. I'd like to talk about. There we go. Robin, for the life of me, I can't even remember what I told him. You guy. weren't writing them down. So, so there you go. So you can see it says the words, which is the same words we have here. Uh, you can see where it says Sal and Kimmel pre-interview. I'm going to hit play up here. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. last, like, they Sal go, well, Jimmy can ask you about this stuff. I, and then I, I... All right, so... Uh, we're looking at all wedding so far, uh, and yeah, so I got this little widget guy here. Like I said, I'll make a full overview, and uh, Google Play Music and Google Maps also recognize the uh, micro SD card, no problem. Uh, and also, I gotta say, uh, again, I'm in the honeymoon phase here, so maybe it's wrong, but the screen looks pretty clear to me, like it's, uh, Google Maps looked great. When I was driving around last night testing out my headlights. Uh, like I said, there are some gaps in here. Like I said, I'll fix all that. Uh, like I said, I'm still getting another amp. I'm going to get an amp and DSP. And the sound's pretty great too. Uh, so I have a couple songs on Google Play Music I go as a test, right? Uh, I even called it Kicker because I have a Kicker subwoofer. Woofer. Stranger Dangers on my guest network is downloading just fine. And so, yeah, so I. That first little bass set's pretty solid. Um, but yeah, these songs I have, a playlist I made just to click that note on other. Uh, my various systems have made the sound pretty great. And it sounds solid here. So, uh, the EQ's pretty good. You got this guy here, standard. Same as the. Uh, I just don't know what, what EQ. That's weird. I thought that was the EQ. That's the settings. There you go. There's EQ. All right. So you got rock and you got pop and jazz. Oh, there's one little weirdness here. The fader's off. So like, it works. It's just these labels are backwards. So like, uh, let's see. Let's let me go back to the other song. Sometimes this is indicative of all the units. Anytime it's downloading like that, it goes a little slower. Right? So these are the songs I know that have a pretty good bass line. I can check to make sure my sub's hidden properly. I'm trying to find one that's not going to get me flagged by YouTube. Then. One in here by a local kid that shouldn't. Well, I'm up. There we go. So this is a local kid. I don't think he has right set up on YouTube. Maybe he does, but. So let's go back. You can hear. I was put on talking with my ex, she said you know So right rear is actually front left. So it's all kind of category. So like right left is my front right. Same thing. Front right is rear left. That's my right. and then and then this is uh, so this is front left it's actually rear left so I guess the fade is backwards right so, no front right so the fade and that could be those plugs I may have them swapped around but at this point they are backwards but alright so that's uh, cool right so you can see me something all right, I just gotta find a way to remap, play, pause, and then pretty sure I got a winner here. And like I said, I'm gonna take all this back out because I gotta, I'm gonna install a front camera and a uh, amp and DSP to go in with my kicker system. And I'll make videos and all that stuff too. But uh, yeah, so this is pretty much good for uh, thumbs up, the covered mic seal of approval. Uh, so far, I'm very happy. With, like, here's a look at the example, right? So, it's one weather. It just formats. I don't know if it's DPI or what it is that 
it just seems to format properly very quickly not quickly um get slow because i'm downloading music in the background i'm downloading several like i've said before in other videos i have about 40 gigs of uh music that's downloading this micro sd card so it's gonna run slow i'll give it that i think in uh now after all that's done if it's still running slow then it'll be a problem i'll update the video but everyone join say to all of my friends slow when you're done downloading this large volumes of music oh you can see there's a forecast right it's all nice and clean it looks there right and so this app in general i like but it fits the screen well and even like the music one right so google play music generally has a pretty terrible interface i like the form the system the best but the interface is pretty terrible but you can see how nice and big this play pause button is right and then uh, lots of easily accessible items there uh, so uh overall pretty i say so a lot don't i so 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 as i was saying the everything's pretty great here uh connects my wi-fi no problem i'm in my driveway of course oh and and backup camera lines uh right we can add those in there so overall pretty happy with this unit again we're only we're still on the first day so it's honeymoon phase of course but like i said uh it's so a join one it didn't fit in here if i wanted a large screen two the one with the amp the internal amp does not work with an external amp so that's a no for me anyhow because i'm gonna get the internal amp for the join sounded okay but not uh just right well, that might be my inability to correct it but either way that's how it was and so then we went to the first say cane which didn't have auto sleep it would stay awake for an hour but didn't have auto sleep and it was an all winter instead of the mtcd uh i just like this one so it was fine uh like i had it i used it for a long time and uh if this didn't work i was gonna go right back to it so it was my preferred unit at the moment the seda was just about perfect but that bluetooth issue not the bluetooth issue the uh well, there was a Bluetooth issue people reported for to say that I did not experience it, but I saw a lot of reports online on XDA about it. Uh, so, and my Bluetooth phone calls, I don't remember how they went, but on this Seikane 6.0, some people said they had problems with Bluetooth phone calls, but I was fine here. So the uh, Deseda had the problem, which was a killer for me. It couldn't do the one hour sleep or the auto sleep and then come back with the micro SD card, right? It would have problems every time uh, you'd have to do a full reboot which I didn't I was not interested in and that also like I said it would lose the app switcher button which sucked so uh, this one is pretty great um, so far I don't have any problems with it uh, obviously I just this video here shows that you can come back from sleep just fine and still recognizes your devices. Uh, oh, yeah. So, all I gotta do now is find out a way to remap a play pause button somewhere. And, in case anyone's watching factory settings to get there, I think it's. Took me a couple times last night. I'm pretty sure it's M and then one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So M, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then you get to these options here, which is, uh, oh, that's what, oh, uh, on the install, my radio sounded a little weird. I had to come in here and change this to America. So, uh, and then you apply it there, right? You can also change your car logo. Like I said, I'll go over all this in an overview video. This is more still part of the install video. Uh, I just wanted to see. There's a way. It should be a way to. Ch oh, I didn't want to do that. I pushed this power button and powered it off. I didn't want to do that. It doesn't really power off, though. It just kind of goes to sleep. Um, yeah, so it seems to be working fine. I was trying to see. Thought there was a way to turn these lights around. Yeah, I 
guess I'll figure it out whenever I get to digging around in here, right? Maybe this place. Anyhow, I'll figure it out. And then I'll have that in my actual overview. For now, the lights work and they come on with your headlights. Um, but they're just white lights like the old ones were. See your about machine. Oh, I guess people like seeing this. Uh, this guy a bunch and see what happens. Yeah, so it looks like do it, right? Alright, so. Uh, looking good so far. And I'll have a full overview in a week or two.